Mages call upon the arcane arts to smite their enemies from a distance. They rely heavily upon the power of flame, such and such. They gain skills with it quickly, though it is not the only force at their disposal. Energy and eyes are also the main at the mage's command, though though the focus is not with those forces primarily. In fact, skills with ice is gained somewhat slower than the skills of flame and energy. While mages are skilled at bom bombarding their enemies while at range, it is also imperative for a mage to keep their enemies some, some distance away, for they are unable to wear anything other than, than keep them from, from a distance anything other than class armor. The control of arcane forces is delicate, difficult, and dangerous art, and as such requires full concentration and the effort of the mage, since the mage is also very reluctant on, on the reliant on the flow of energy around them, they must literally feel it. Thus the mage is limited strictly to the use of cloth armor for their protection, and as they tink thicker and heavier leather and metal armor severely reduce the mage's ability to keep in touch with the energies around them. Also due to the complex nature of the swirling energies and many diff different ways a mage must interact with these energies, it takes a certain amount of time for them to learn to master their art, wearing different pieces of different types of cloth. A mage must retrain themselves with each different type of cloth they wear to be able to discern the suitable distance in the way energy flows over them. Income mage mages aren't forced to rely entirely on their spells. If any does come does happen to, to get close to them, Mages are able to wield daggers and staffs to defend themselves. Because of this, it is natural for a mage to pick up some skills of one-handed piercing weapons and two-handed crushing weapons. It is also natural for a mage to craft their own spells by joining a sc scholar crafting school. If you would like more information about entangling crafting your own spells, please speak to Gamus about joining the scholar school. So, then... Do you wish to join the main school, or would you perhaps hear about some other school? We're going to click join main school. As you can see, we went back down to one again. Happens. 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 Congratulations. You are now a member of the main school. This is not an easy school to progress in, in early along. As the skills and power you have available to you are quite limited. Since mages are not able to wear any type, type of armor, they must focus on more powerful offense to compete with their incompetently weaker defense. Now in regards to your offense, I have given you a basic spell for you to, to use called Flame Bolt, as well as a refurbished Cedar Corda staff. You'll, you, you should scribe the spell and equip the staff now, but I would also encourage you to see Sigamma crafting your own spells, equipment, at Sigamma Carson. The next thing you need to learn is how to keep yourself alive. Let's go to the next thing. Mages gain an ability called Safety early on, which uses magic to enhance their, their existing armor. I would like you to get comfortable relying on this and find exactly what it is it can and cannot protect you from. In order to do this, naturally you'll need, need to have something attacking you. There are some native grounds on the island down down the paved road behind me, me a ways. Head down the road, use the safety ability, and, and yeah. Okay. Let's go 
inventory. Let's go character. We're going to add the safety and the enhanced bolt we get to our bar. Both of these will help us. Now, we're also going to equip all the flax and armor we were just given. This will help us out greatly. It'll give us a little bit more protection than just running around in the nude. We're also going to equip the staff he gave us. Voila. We're also going to inscribe the flame boat spell that we got. Now, I am going to hit... Open up our knowledge. I'm going to drag the flame bolt down, and voila! Also, on another note, you know that revitalize that we learned? We can still use it in this class. So we do have a healed spell that we can use. Now let's go kill us some gromlins until we hit two. As you can see, we got got the buff on us now for safety. So let's hit two. Let's hit three. Now we're going to loot it. We're going to repeat this process as for long as we need to. just away is very beneficial because we can then cast several spells at our, our target. Now instead of recalling like it wants us to, we're just going to run back up the hill and turn in. going to open up a quest log, see exactly what he wants us to do. He wants us to kill four hundred and he wants us to use our enhanced flame bolt. Alrighty, we're going to run over here. We're going to drop down. Whoop. Not where I wanted to drop down, but it will work. No, it will work. I'm gonna recall. <laughs> I ran the wrong way. Oops. Oops. Oops, oops. I ran away from the buffs, not to them. Alrighty. The way we needed to go was over here where all the flexes. Because we need the spiders again.
have killed enough, now we're recalling. Now we're going to turn in. We're going to get our next challenge. Let's look at our quest log and figure out what that is. He wants us to kill by beetles. There's a problem. We, I don't believe we have the engulf spell yet. Let's check our abilities. We actually do. Nice. Well, I'm gonna drag that to our bar. Cause the engulf ability will do very well. So come on, let's go. And he wants us to kill beetles, so it's time to drop off over here because that's a quicker way to get to them.
Okay, we're going to try abandoning the quest. And we're getting it and seeing if that will allow us to complete the buff part of engulf part of this quest. If not, that means that quest is bugged and no clue why. I'm sorry, you will have to watch me do this all over again. I'm 
sorry to tell you all this, but the Mage 3 part... The Mage 3 quest is broken. As you can see, I have been using the spell and everything, so I'm afraid we are not going to be able to complete this like we thought. I am sorry you have to see this, um, but that just means we're going to be grabbing the last quest available to us. Which we're going to be given by Raisin here. So, let's grab it. Greet him. Now we're heading, like I said, we're going to drop off over here. And, whoa. We turn that in. We're going to drop run over here. We're going to drop off, and we're going to go to New Christmas. That's where the end of this video will will be. I hope you have enjoyed watching. I'm sorry there's not more to the Mage Quest line. Mage Part Three is broken. I may come back another time on another biped and finish those out. Once that is fixed, see you all then. We're teleporting to New Christmas now. Once I arrive at New Christmas,